Here at the University of Derby, we're all about applied research. And the beauty of Vicon and the IMU units is the ability to kind of translate uh, research into practice. It offers an amazing tool. We can actually really understand climbing movement from a scientific point of view and then actually translate that into practice. Traditionally, climbing has been viewed in terms of a, just a video camera or just a coach's eye. What we're trying to do is take a lot of that guesswork out and really provide really detailed objective data for coaches, for athletes to improve their sport. Research we're using here at Derby is focusing on the Vicon cameras. We've got 12 cameras, we've then got the IMUs, we've got 10 at the moment, we're hoping to purchase some more as we move forward. Vicon offers an amazing tool where we can actually explore climbing movement uh, from a scientific point of view and really develop our understanding of, kind of climbing performance, how to improve performance and also how to kind of reduce injury as well. What's been amazing is the connectivity between Bicon, Motion Capture, IMU and Nexus. It's just really seamlessly integrated, which means we can kind of pass on all that data to coaches and athletes. Combining the optical motion capture and the IMUs has been really, really valuable. We can use that data from the IMUs alongside the, the Viacon capture to better understand these techniques. So from both a coaching point of view, you could look at what you're doing differently compared with better climbers or from climbers who can do the thing that you can't do. And also from a research point of view, you could look at trends that are different between very good climbers and less good climbers. It potentially answers a lot of the questions which we've not been able to answer using previous techniques. It just provides a level of detail we've not experienced before, which can help us improve kind of climbing movement. Really amazing to see all the advances they're constantly coming up with uh, new and better ways to help us measure performance and actually improve performance in the future. And it's really exciting that we're actually now able to take this technology into kind of real world environments. So we've got less constraints and actually it makes it much easier to translate this to coaches and to athletes. The end point is, in terms of performance, can we then give coaches a set of tools based on all our detailed kinematics and all the data that we collect with the Vicon systems to work on and go, if we want this athlete to be at this top level in the next few years, this is what they need to work on. <laughs>